well, this base station is starting to make some some sounds the second we powered it on. Okay, going to plug it in. It's been making noises. So this is the second base station we're going to plug in. This one doesn't seem to be making the noises. It's, it's possible that our first space station that we've ever installed was defective. We're gonna, luckily we have two sets, so we're gonna try it with the other one. So for shorter distances, it seems to work okay. It, it, it might work on a longer distance, but we haven't changed the base station yet. Yeah, we have to test it. Tracking with uh, base stations about, how far are these now from each other? Yeah. So this is a 20 by 20 box. Doing the track. Doing the setup right now. Yeah. All right. I mean, it's saying the max is four meter by four meter on here, but I mean, like that was the same thing as before. Right. Can you center it in the space? Yeah. I think they're off. It works at all. Yeah. It was working before. Oh, it's detecting three now. Oh, what? So it's detecting three. How's your? I'm still dead. Your what? I'm still dead. Is it working? Uh, Don't go too far, because you're no, so... Right, right, right. <laughs> but it's detecting three base stations? Yeah, That's good. On. How do I do this again? Explain here. Okay. Now we're testing with one, two, three, and number four. I've only gotten these two. Oh, wow. So... Okay, you got three. Do you, do you only see two base stations? Correct. Okay, with our dud base station, there is four now. I got... Yeah, it's, it's not, the firmware is not built for this yet. Four base stations. Four, yeah. So where do you see base stations? So my initial impression with Steam Tracking 2.0 is that it seems to be working great with the Vive Pro and the new Vive Wands. However, we did have 50%, a 50% rate of duds uh, with, our, with our lighthouses, with our 2. Steam VR 2.0 lighthouses. Um, so we're gonna have to RMA two of them. We did try to test what we could. Uh, of the two that were working, everything seemed to work fine. We tried a range in a 20 foot by 20 foot square and it seemed to track great. We added our two duds and even though SteamVR was picking them up, it wasn't tracking very well at all and we were just skipping hopping all over the place. So we can't tell if it's working with four base stations yet. We can't verify, we don't know if it was a software issue or um, just a, a base station issue. So we can't tell right now. Um, other than that, everything seems great. When we get two more working base stations, then we'll be, we'll be able to really tell if we can support if it can support up to four.